Last night, we had the return of the monthly women's forum. Last night, every Thursday night, we'll be doing this. As long as the Lord says so, and the creek don't rise, we will be doing the monthly meetings or forums with the ladies. And, uh, and uh, I have to tell you, everybody and their mama showed up, a truckload of ladies showed up last night. And it was a beautiful start, a beautiful new beginning of the women's form. Open, honest, seeking women who want to return to the Father, who want to love what's right, do what's right, and be right. And we had a really, really good meeting last night. And I thank the ladies for it. I thank them for showing up. And uh, it went overtime. And the meetings are like from 7 to 8.30. We want to start on time, get out, just get up and walk away. But it was very, very good. It went over about 30 minutes or so uh, because it was so interesting. Very, very interesting. Everybody and their mama showed up. And thank you, ladies. And I have to tell you, some of the ladies came a far away. You know, they came from Orange County and other areas where they had to fight the traffic. It's major traffic that time of evening trying to get into L.A. And it meant so much to them. They fought the traffic. They got there. And, uh, uh, you know, how can you not appreciate that? How can I not show up when you have people like that who are desperately looking for answers? They want to return to God, to their father. And so it was good. And we can't talk about what happened in the meeting, uh, in the men's meeting and the women's meeting, except for church. You talk about whatever you want at church. But um, we take a vow not to... Whatever is said within the meeting stays in the meetings. You can't go out and tell anyone. You can't go out and call each other and gospel about it. And so that helped people to relax and open up even more so. It was major. It was really, I realized so much from those meetings, and especially last night one. The men's meeting too. But I realized a lot from last night meeting. And uh, so, thank you, ladies. We are having church this Sunday. It is Father's Day Sunday. We're having church. For, and church is for everybody. Men, women, and children of all ages, ages, all races. All right? So, come to church. It starts at 11 a.m. Doors open at 1030. Church is for everyone. Um, also, I'm excited. A little bit. We have it our eighth annual men's conference tomorrow. Tomorrow, tomorrow, will you love me tomorrow? Tomorrow at 5 p.m. Tomorrow at 5 p.m. We'll have it our men's form. There are some nice surprises that's going to be happening tomorrow, too. I talked to some folks that... Uh, it's going to be there, and it's going to be a surprise to a lot of folks uh, at the meeting tomorrow, at the forum, uh, the conference, the men's uh, Father Day conference on Saturday night. For more information about all of this, go to rebuildingtheman.com, rebuildingtheman.com slash events or event. It's for ages 13 and up, 13 and up. So, and... I think those folks who have uh, sponsored, who helped sponsor the meeting and, and also pay for guys who can't afford it. That's pretty cool. Thank you so much. It's your chance to do that. All right. It is tomorrow at 5 p.m. from 5 to 8. So you can go on the website at rebuildingtheman.com slash event or call 800-411-BOND, 800 800- Four one one two six six three. If you like to sponsor, or someone, or donate to the event, or or sponsor the whole entire event, parts of the event, we appreciate it. Every dime that is left over goes back into the nonprofit. All right.